Here in Birmingham, the state high school basketball tournament has wrapped and now the focus shifts to preparing for the long awaited return of March Madness. WDTM 13's Chip Scarborough is live in Birmingham tonight where all eyes will soon be on the Magic City. Chip. Oh, that's right, Lisa. College basketball fans from around the country will soon be laying eyes on the Birmingham skyline as they make their way into town for the first round of the NCAA playoff games just over a week from now. For the first time since 2008, March Madness is returning to the Magic City. The first of the first round playoff games set for March 16th. And we weren't going to be able to do another one without investing in the building. And to be awarded those dates in 23 and then 25 also before the work actually even started to shows the belief in, in what Birmingham is as a market. The area around the BJCC and Legacy Arena has been crawling with high school basketball fans in recent days as teams from all over Alabama gathered for the state tournament. College basketball fans will soon flood the area. There's so many cool places to eat and stay. Um, just a lot of excursions that you can do while you're here. It really put Birmingham on the map. And the city's exposure is only expected to grow as more events are scheduled at the BJCC and Legacy Arena. It definitely is. It definitely is. Um, good economic boost for the city and for all of us, all of us Alabama fans. The executive director of the BJCC does say one thing crews are dealing with right now is damage to a portion of the seating in Legacy Arena from a recent monster truck event. One of the trucks ran into the retractable seating. But we're working with a company now uh, based here in Birmingham. Used to be called A Group, now Revel XP. They're going to rebuild that section of the sands. We'll be good to go for basketball. But yeah, it is one of the kind of unforeseen things that happened with monster trucks where one of the trucks you know, got out of control. All right, so the countdown is on. Just 12 days to go until Birmingham is in the national spotlight. Of course, we'll be covering it all for you right here on WVTM 13. Live in Birmingham tonight, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13.